lots of quality teaching happening. Are you ready? Set. Teach. Okay. Hi, everyone. How is everyone doing today? Okay, well, you guys can do better than I. Come on. Woo! and backpacks and whatever else you have by your chairs, and I need you to not take out your instruments until I tell you to do so. So, I want you to put your instrument cases right in front of you, make sure they're right side up, handle large part on the bottom, and the smaller part on the top, and carefully unlatch the top part from the bottom part, like a lid. And I want everyone, remember how we told um, everyone how to put their instruments together? I want you to carefully put your all, put all of your instruments together, how we learn how, and, and put them in your laps. Now, for our purpleless or our string players in the room, since you guys don't have a mouthpiece, um, do with just your, with just your mouth, but um, for everyone else who has a mouthpiece today, I'd like you to take just your mouthpiece out, keep your instruments in your laps. And so today we're gonna learn a scale, but first we're going to make sure we remember our articulation. So take your mouthpiece in your right hand and put it out to your mouth. And we're just gonna buzz a note. So everyone just buzz whatever you can. Right now, go. <laughs> nice, and can I have the, the brass players do a siren for me? Go, stuff again and we're going to buzz four counts and I'll clap with you okay ready one two three go <laughs> all right awesome let's try it one more time and make sure you get good articulation all right ready one two three go <laughs> So I'm so pleased with your articulation. <laughs> that was so much better. Um, now, can you guys please carefully put your mouthpieces into your horns and put them up to your faces? So we're going to play a B flat scale. And remember, with all respective instruments, what that scale is for you. And play that B flat concert pitch, whatever note is the first note in your scale. So go ahead and do that right now. <laughs>
Oh, it was a beep? Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about a couple things. How many of you played a scale because you knew what a scale was? So you made the assumption that everyone in the room had the same set of knowledge coming in. Is that something that you did intentionally? Uh, well, I kind of thought maybe like, instead of like being like very like beginner, like we have already like gone over like a little bit of stuff at least. So like maybe we were just like, like more like further along than just like first day, you know? So it was a little intentional, but. Because what, what you said was, I'm gonna teach you how to play a scale, here we go, and then they the magically play a scale. You see what I'm getting at? Yeah, yeah. Also, the other thing that I wanna say is eye contact. How many of you felt like she made eye contact with the group throughout her lesson? Eye contact and keeping your head up is critical because even if you are unsure about what you're doing, if your chin is slightly above level and your face is open, you can convince almost any group you know what you're doing. I do it on a regular basis. That's supposed to be funny. <laughs> any other comments? And a positive guy. Any other comments? Yes. Okay, uh, thank you guys for your excellent work today. We will finish up these on Wednesday. We're over halfway through. I will have.